welcome back to another episode of Stretch and Fade in the clothes we wore last week. Cause I we, don't change my clothes. Yeah, that's for sure. I'm a dirty bitch. Yeah. Can you get that on the record? Yep. Um, yeah, I hate what people say. Scratch that from the record. We should have a court reporter just because. Just because? Just c- relax. Dude spends one day in L.A. Forget about it, cuh. Nah, for real, man. Hey, what it is? Ah, almost slipped out right there. Dude. Wait a minute, what? What slipped out? What it is, ho? You almost, you almost oh, gave it. You yeah, almost yeah, gave it. You almost gave it. One of these days, it's gonna be an evolutionary like. It'll be there. Yeah. Right and there. just your. Let's talk about Ryan's shoes, man. Those shits are ass. Oh, here's man, my man. Those shoes are ass, yeah. man. <laughs> for real. Like, okay, for do real. do a Ryan impression now. <laughs> That's it, dude. Bingo. My name is Stretch. This is the last time you mess with Stretch. Ah! Ah! Fade. Welcome back. Ladies and gentlemen, we're bringing our boy Spock on today because Spock, I'm going to let him tell, Spock, get in here. I'm going to let him tell it, but he did. I also just want to reiterate, too, that Spock was so happy to come on. Noel basically fucking forced him off the set. Yeah. Spock, out of embarrassment, basically was getting around the corner. He's like, not that far, fucking idiot. Yeah. He had to sit, like, closer. So okay, well, let's this remember. is your good friend. Yeah, well, Spock knows when I'm in podcast mode. <laughs> yeah, it's, just, it's just that yeah, content he this creator. Thing. Yeah, he, ca- yeah. he calls it podcast mode. Yeah, when I start hitting him. <laughs> yeah. Podcast mode. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> It's a good superhero oh, form. Shit, dude. It's <laughs> brass knuckles. Podcast mode. Ah! Yeah. So. Alina doesn't like that one. Yeah. <laughs> this thing is crazy. We, need, we, can, we do need to just get this the fuck off. The yeah. <laughs> it's the <laughs> loudest fucking thing. Yeah. Noah's like, yeah, what happened? Like, it's it's so loud. Good God. Bring fidget spinners yeah. back. <laughs> <laughs> What's up? Welcome to the pod. Yeah. Noah's been hyping up this fucking story, so I hope it's good. It's is pretty it damn is. good. I don't know if it's as good as you think, but... <laughs> I think maybe it what is. What kind of show are we running here, man? We got to have gold. It is, or you have to have the confidence. To I give think us you'll gold. think it's interesting because I thought of an interesting, um, like analogy. Okay. So basically, the story goes: <laughs> my friend, every year on his birthday, we're all DJs, right? So me and my boys, yeah, we're all DJs. This. He's a sick DJ. I'm a sick DJ from LA. Yeah. From LA. Yeah. From LA. You get pussy. You sling coke. <laughs> yeah. And you drop beats. Yeah. Wait, from where again? From where? LA. Yeah. LA. 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 So from LA. So my friend calls me. He's like, yo, I'm doing a birthday thing. Every year on his birthday, he does this like show um, in Hollywood. You know, Hollywood. I've seen the sign. So it's it's there. It's in Hollywood. He uh, and just reiterate, this is like a sick ass show that his friend puts on every year yeah. for his birthday yeah. with like all his sick ass DJ. Yeah. We're DJs. At, it's, it's in, in LA. Ho- it's in Hollywood. Okay. LA. Yeah. It's right. in law in Hollywood. Yeah, um, it's a dubstep show. I don't know if you know is anything dubstep about still, dubstep. Is dubstep still around? It is still oh, around. Oh, 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 <laughs> be careful, it. dude. Hey, be careful. I didn't know. <laughs> I had no idea. So <laughs> he has so, no idea. He has no just, idea. I, 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 I literally have no, no idea. idea. Guys, I didn't say that. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know which of these twenty oh, cameras. So, oh, okay. Yo, I'm glad we have twenty cameras. We are at Richard Nixon's hearing right now yeah. with the amount of fucking cameras we have. It's crazy. I just have to. We also, say. we also have just a fucking Saudi prince here with his white pants. You made yeah. in the fucking cameras here. So yeah, it's yeah. Like. yeah. <laughs> hey, you get that out of there. It's crazy. When Ryan goes shopping for pants, he's like, "Which one will show my helmet the most?" <laughs> Welcome to Kohl's. Yeah. I have all this Kohl's cash. Can I buy some <laughs> pants? <laughs> Hi, I would like a pair of pants that shows my penis uncomfortably. I'm kind of hard. Yeah. Just a little bit. <laughs> and then, uh, do you have any light up shoes? <laughs> Bring hi, back. yeah, hi. I'm 35, and I would like a pair of shoes that are pink, green, purple, <laughs> red, yellow, blue, like and orange. <laughs> you know what, Ryan? Honestly, I think oh, it's gone man. too far. 
I didn't see his shoes before, so I thought you were just being mean, but you weren't. I think they've gone too far. They've gone too far. <laughs> I'm, I'm these about two, to go into these podcast two, mode. Gonna fuck Watch you. out. <laughs> podcast mode. <laughs> You're at a party. Anyway, a I'm at party. a party. Whoa, whoa, whoa. This is a show, no, dude. dude. This is a dubstep show. But you said it's your friend's birthday. So that's what I, th my friend just called me. He's like, hey, I'm doing this thing. Do you want to play it? I'm like, yeah, cool. Okay. I don't really know. He, he does it every year. I did it last year too. Um, DJ party in Hollywood last sure, year, my friend's sure. birthday. That He's a DJ. Yep. So uh, it's a dubstep show in LA, in Hollywood. <laughs> <laughs> I, I have fully captured okay, that okay. picture. I just want to make sure that's clear. Just want to make uh, sure you know. It is crystal clear. So anyway, uh, I'm I, I don't really want to play dubstep. Yeah. But it's a dubstep show. So what I've been doing the past few shows, I don't really play. I'm not really a DJ anymore. So the past few shows mean, that I've, I, I just don't really DJ anymore. I just. But you don't. said you were a DJ. I was a DJ. Currently, not as much anymore. Just oh, just or, for what things are you doing like. Now? I just produce the music. I don't really DJ. Okay. So um, he calls me to DJ it, and I'm like, cool, yeah, I'll do it. I'm like, okay, I'm only playing like top 40, 2000, 2012 top 40 music. Sure. Awesome. Pitbull, Kesha, Skrill. Lady Gaga. Skrill? Skrill? No, no Skrill. No Skrill. No that's Skrill. Not top, how is that not top 40? Because that's like dubstep. Yeah, but that's a dubstep deal. So why right, you, my boy play doesn't that. play dubstep oh, My boy anymore. doesn't. I just didn't. Okay. I, well, and there's like Is five other people. Gig? Yeah. I wouldn't pay you then. <laughs> no. I want a dubstep <laughs> thing. You kind of no, come and not play but any nobody skrill, told me, dog? Nobody told me that. That, you, that was the first thing you said at the dubstep. Oh, you said you just well, want to DJ it. Well, he just said it's my birthday event. So basically every week there's this event thing that they do free shows. Every week it's like a secret lineup. Nobody really knows who's going to be there. Okay. Um, like... So whatever, it's just just like a weekly thing, sure. and then every year, they my friend does like a birthday show with them. Okay. So that's what it was. Mm -hmm. I did the same thing last year. I played thirty minutes of like top forty stuff, then thirty minutes of dubstep. Everyone loved it. So I was like, cool. I'm gonna do the same thing again this year, but I don't want to play dubstep. I'm just gonna play like fun music. And so I did. <laughs> okay. and, dude, you're in trouble, dude. You're in dubstep trouble is not it. fun. Yeah, 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 okay, Anybody okay. who like it. They they would admit this. Like yeah. dubstep is not. This chair is also broken. Ryan, no, I'm joking. <laughs> can we put your shoe get under those here? Goofy ass yeah, shoes over here. Yeah. Fix yeah. those fucking no, no. those fucking foam those, those foam posit. These are yeah. good shoes. Weird Dude. color pastel look mud boots you got on over here. And hey, man, bowling's in later. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Ryan's anyway. gripping the fucking yeah. thing as hard as he can. That's funny. Yeah, it's yeah. That's a good one. <laughs> So you go to the anyway, field, so you're playing it, people are playing I'm playing, playing the thing. A lot of people love it. Okay. Some people don't love it. Okay. And they're really pissed. And they're holding up like, you know, they like uh they type little things on their phone and like oh, show that yeah, yeah, it's yeah, like yeah, sell yeah. out. <laughs> like someone it says sell out. someone held up sell out. Sell out. And there's somebody posted a video like from behind the DJ booth of and it's me. I'm playing uh Wasn't it hot, hot in here. Hot in here. I'm playing hot in here. Somebody's holding a sign that says sell out. <laughs> and it's just really funny because it's like, <laughs> what? Like, I'm just having fun. How long did the dubstep era even last? It's still going, still but it's going. different. It, so now it's much more like, you're a metal guy. So you'll get, it's much more like underground. It's like, like underground death metal is what it's like now. So like. It oh, would, so now it's not like mainstream to like it's it not, anymore. It's not, it's. But ironically, it, like it is more mainstream, but it's like the, the like underground fan base. I'm so lost <clears> on even like electronic music in general. So where it's like, because like I hear stuff like I see like mansion tours of that fucking guy. What's his name? Zed. Yeah. Does he make that? Is that a dubstep? No, guy? he's no. like pop. All the dubstep kids would hate him. And can uh, we can we just be really clear right now? <laughs> so. Spock did not know this was a dubstep show. It was just yeah, like his. It was just his homie hitting him up, being yeah. like, "You want to come play?" He's like, "I did the same thing last year. I'm gonna just play the sure the fun stuff." And his boy's like, "Yeah, cool." So he goes and does it. But what I wanted to talk about today yeah, yeah, yeah. were the fucking comments. <laughs> yeah, they're bro. I'll have to show you some, bro. We're gonna read some right now. When we say people were pissed, that's an understatement. You, did, was it? 
was the set like posted somewhere or oh. something like that? Or no, what? no, like, it was just the people there were like so mad that they came and commented on like on your stuff, on my st- on not really on my stuff, but on like the the like events, the thing. event page. Like whatever. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah like yeah. on like the Instagram, they yeah they posted like dude, you know whatever. Uh, Can we say the names of the people posting too? They're just like Instagram <laughs> handles. Yeah, but... yeah that's funny. <laughs> <laughs> is it? Well, I, mean, I think so. <laughs> Shrek Boy Twenty Two says, "Dude, the fucking music sucked." No, bro. Let, let me. I kept playing let, Fetty Wap on repeat. Let me. So, go real ahead. quick, just to. It's kind of the equivalent of like if you showed up to like a free death metal show, mm. and like one of the bands just played Justin Bieber. So like some that's people a super see th- that's too much of an extreme way. I feel like you're saying it's a it's death metal show. It's not because so the the like the whole dubstep scene right now is very like death metally. Like it's super all about elitist. like mosh pits and the elitist and like uh like we're hardcore. Yeah, okay. And so I just showed the up. drop goes so hard. <laughs> right. It you get it now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Is, is it is it still the same kind of like I'll say it's like I'll it's, show you some because it's yeah, very I, I, like metal adjacent. Hmm. Um, it hits harder now. Yeah, it's much, much harder, harder now, mm. and all the branding is like evil, scary. Nice. Um, Fuck. But yeah, so it's kind of the equivalent of that. Mad at you? He's like, so no. So, but it's the equivalent the of like <laughs> if yeah. you if you went to a death metal show and one like the whole lineup's death metal, one person plays Justin Bieber, you'd be like, this is kind of awesome. Right. Right. Yeah. But there's gonna be some people at the show who are like. We only want Cannibal Corpse. Yeah, well, fuck those guys. Right, and so yeah. that's these people. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, and it's just funny. <laughs> so yeah, I gotta, I gotta read yeah. one of these. <clears throat> so this is like a top comment on one of the posts. I just want to say a big three middle finger emojis. Bang, bang, bang. Yeah. Two at Spock Music for completely ruining the mood mm. and playing bullshit. By top one hundred oldies mm. that he didn't even try to remix no. for most of his set mm. also three middle fingers to the promoter for allowing him to do this at your quote big bass tings with a z event <laughs> what an epic fail <laughs> what's a big bass bass tings that's the that's name the of the show big bass called. tings Okay, <laughs> and he says, "What an epic fail!" And he punchlines it with the fucking hand over face emoji, <laughs> a yellow one, so you know he's racist. Mm-hmm. Yeah, epic fail. Epic I fail. Think the only person left that was Nick in the background. <laughs> <laughs> oh, cool! I made Nick feel something. It's my editor. Come on, it's like one of my friends. Harry's. What was his handle? <laughs> 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 Uh, Shrek Cookie Monster 22. Wait, do the... the There's who? Squirrel Dog 75. Um, no, no, no. I mean, Dude, can... there was a funnier one. I, I think s- I didn't send All it All-Star Skrillex is like... He, he, I think he has like a fucking residency in Vegas. Yeah. yeah. And he plays like all the time in Vegas. Yeah. yeah. He's, been, he's been good. Oh, wait, dude. So here's another great one. So... <laughs> <laughs> there was a... There I was feeling sorry for the DJ because I thought he lost his USB and had to play off the club's USB with 2010's Top 40 songs only to find out he was doing that shit on purpose at a bass show. Blacklist his ass, bruh. (laughs) Blacklist. (laughs) Yeah, the funny thing, there was one... Oh, yeah, wait... Spock trolled all of us. That smug look on his face, don't lie. I, I felt like I was in a hell loop of a middle school dance party. What were you playing? <laughs> Worst show I've ever been to. What could you have possibly I was playing? playing? I was playing like 2000, like literally like Pitbull. Like, <laughs> I would have been like, pissed too. No, you wouldn't. You would have loved it. Get the fucking Pitbull off. You would have loved it. Lady Gaga. Mr. International. Pitbull. All right, I mean, it would Owl City, fun. Fireflies. Well, so it's like, that's a nice break in between. It's stuff. fun. That's so, what I did thought. Did someone play after you? Yeah. yeah it's a nice it was break. fun. Why not? That's what I thought. Dude, you know what I said? I think they're all, I got triggered because like they were like there to listen to dubstep to like be in hardcore mode and like hide from society. And Spock played a bunch of music that reminded them of standing on the wall in, at like a high school dance and they all just got fucking pissed. Yeah. Like they're like, yo, stop. <laughs> Turn that shit off. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Turn that fucking shit off, man. <laughs> For real. So, so wait, are the are the dubstep people? Because I know that like 
people at the mosh. Yeah, and yeah. rap pits now, right? That's what it yeah, is. Yeah. yeah, it's like that. So it's like young, like younger people. Mm-hmm. You would think, mm-hmm. but like, somebody, like even twenty one, you think? Yeah. So yeah. this this was like only this is like twenty one. Twenty one. Okay. Yeah. Some of these people, like when you look at their profiles, they're too old to be acting like this. Mm-hmm. Yeah, some guy guy in his bathroom, like he's in a dark bathroom <laughs> with like a flash, <laughs> and he's like selfie himself <laughs> without a shirt on. Well, what's funny is like in my, it's like they're all about my age, maybe a bit younger, so like mid twenties probably. Mm. So this is all the music that like they would have been liking in like middle school and high school. So to me, I'm like, oh, this is fun music, but for some reason they're like extremely. Ha- I honestly think it. that if you would have just played some death metal shit, they would have been like, okay. They probably would. This would've. is a good breather. They would uh, maybe. Yeah. I, it's just such a weird like for them to think I'm like trolling them or something. That stuff like, just seems so like corny though. Yeah, I mean it's a lot of like it's like it's just a weird thing because it's so like it's so intentionally like like that's why I compare it to death metal because it's like all the branding is the same. It's the same like unreadable fonts mm-hmm. with like <laughs> scary imagery and yeah, stuff yeah, yeah. and it's like that's cool. <laughs> But like you realize that's just a brand. Like well, none you, of these it, people it, it's like it's all this. these people who are like it's the same shit with like some hardcore stuff. Yeah. Hardcore's really funny to me too, because it's like the underground thing where it's right. like people just don't fucking get it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And, it's like, and like you don't get fu- like like especially straight edge guys. Oh yeah. Straight edge hardcore is like one of the fucking lamest <laughs> things. Because yeah. all the music is like dun dun and this guy's like, I want my tears from my eyes. Yeah. Because yeah. you said I wasn't good enough. Yeah. Dun dun dun. Yeah. And he's like, yeah, pleased to meet you, motherfucker. <laughs> is that kind of yeah, it's like, you know what I mean? it's like that, basically. Where you're like, how yeah. fucking corny is this, dude? <laughs> Some, like, super ripped, like, guy on stage. Yeah. It's, it is, yeah, it's pretty much like that. Uh, and it's, that's what's so funny to me is it's like, no, nah, I was just trying to have fun. <laughs> like, I wasn't, yeah. this wasn't about, oh, like, trolling you. Boom! <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm just, I came here to I've had five hours of this. Like, yeah. I just wanted to have fun. Yeah. <laughs> and then, yeah, just, yeah, to see the response was just like, oh. So triggered. I wasn't trying. I was just having fun. Yeah, <laughs> I, don't, yeah. I don't know what you want from me. Yeah. Bro, yeah. I'm just dying laughing at, at after three hours of. Yeah. 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 You just, just like want to hear some fucking yeah you just you just yeah you yeah. just play just like something a little soft and it's like some fucking twenty seven year old dude with like eyeliner and shit and like yeah. fishnet clothing like yo what the fuck yeah. bro I came here to rage like what I is I came this? to rage what the fuck I, what it is yeah <laughs> it's so not fun like yeah. the whole scene is like very not fun yeah that's the majority of metal shows too that's that's what I mean white trash dudes who are like big who want to like just like fucking like punch yeah. somebody in a in a circle or whatever. Yeah. 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 Anyways, man, I don't know. I just thought it was super funny how angry yeah. these people got at you. Really I, I had mad. no idea. I had no idea that dubstep was such a cool new thing. Yeah, <laughs> it's like very serious. I didn't know that it came back in such a. Hip it, style. it came back in a way that's like before it used to be like the raver kids, and now it's like the anti raver kids. Well, now it feels like. Well, it's just, that's what I'm saying. It's so weird. Yeah. Because back in the day, I remember like my friend would literally go to Buckle and buy jeans and like an affliction <laughs> shirt. Yeah, it was like And he that. was listening to Asking Alexandria and like some dubstep bullshit. Yeah. That's like what it was. Yeah. And now it's like knocked loose fans or something. Do you know hardcore Yeah, fans? yeah, exactly. I want my You don't know who I am! I don't pretend you do! <laughs> this is the last time you'll break my heart! <laughs> yeah, it's that. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Dude, whatever happened to the fucking oldies, right? <laughs> When's an ACDC night coming back, dude? That'd be fun. Ah! I'd be a down for that, dude. Yeah. Like AC/DC night. You seen that? Um, you seen that that hardcore band where the guy talks about how he used to jerk off horses? <laughs> I'm I'm genuinely asking. No. You seen that TikTok? No. It's, fuck, man. It's epic as fuck. That's like the coolest thing I've ever seen out of hardcore. Because the music isn't. <laughs> <laughs> I like me some hardcore, don't get me wrong, but it's just those kind of bands where it's the screaming. But no, it's no, like, I know. It's a giant, bulky man who's extremely emotionally fragile. Yeah. <laughs> That's just about all of them. No, this dude gives a pretty like epic rant about, he's like, every day, da-da, I used to get up and go to a horse farm. And I used to jack off the horse. It seems wild. And everyone's like, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I always, like, I always think of the Denny's thing, the Denny slam. Oh yeah, was, that was. I mean, that's so, like the, one of the coolest things mm, ever. Yeah. Did you ever see that one? 
Uh, what the, the fuck is up, Denny's? <laughs> it's like they, they they couldn't play at this venue. Oh right, so right, right, yeah, right, right, so right, right, right. Literally yeah. in a Denny's. What the fuck is up, Denny's? <laughs> yeah, yeah, so tight. No, but then the dude's like, and I and I used to get up every day at four a.m. Bam, bam, and I go jerk off those horses for some rich guy. To sell the fucking cum. And he's for like some absurd money. He basically worked at like a racehorsing stable. And he's like, and then I realized either you own the horse or you, you are the horse. You are the no horse. No way. Or you just jack off the horse. Da, 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 da. <laughs> and then it just kicks off. I'm like, damn. I would have been hyped. Yeah. Yeah, that's awesome. <laughs> if a guy used hard. that as motivation to get me to like move, yeah. I definitely would. Dude. Yeah. yeah. That's yeah, a dude. fucking surreal experience. Yeah. Jerking off horses. I am the horse. Yeah. It's kind of sound like he was going to beat off on stage, though. It's kind of what it sounds like. <laughs> you are either jack off a horse or you are the horse. <laughs> like, like, yeah. He just stops there. Who's going to get up <laughs> yeah. here and jack this dick yeah. off? I went, yeah, to a, went to a Rammstein concert in uh, high school, and the dude was like riding this giant mechanical dick shooting like foam into the crowd. Oh, yeah, t- yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it was pretty crazy. Yeah, Rammstein concerts yeah. rule, dude. <laughs> they have some of the best music videos, too. Yeah. Anyway. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, nice favorite. man yeah yeah so ramstein yeah don't you mean ramstein rumstein yeah you ever been to a show no Mm-mm. nope they don't they don't really tour in the states i don't think no they don't they don't think they really care for this country very much yeah yeah, yeah. <laughs> just let you know but i mean they just, <laughs> yeah, I don't know. yeah. Just, oh yeah they don't have they ever toured america like one, well, when i went that to get time. the bag yeah yeah <laughs> yeah well, if they ever want to do a DJ show yeah. in uh, yeah. in Hollywood, oh fuck, man! I'll show up and play yeah. top forty, <laughs> yeah, dude. Yo, you fucking absolute troll! Yeah. So, what is this podcast about? Like, what is this? Anything. Nothing. Nothing. Just fucking us. nothing. It's just kind of a thing. Like, it's uh, yeah. <laughs> I've never watched it, so I just yeah. I just thought I'd oh, ask. some friend, okay. some friend, yeah. bro. Yeah. No. Uh. A lot of emotional complexities, a lot of character development and growth. Yeah, man, a lot of like, spirits don't fucking laugh over there. <laughs> <laughs> and a lot of spiritual teachings and stuff. And we mostly actually we go chapter by chapter of reading the secret. And we talk about how it's <laughs> yeah. applicable to our lives. Yeah. And you so, ever hear that little diddle? Yeah, I've uh I had a friend who was really into that book, and so I read it. I listened to the audio book while I was driving Grubhub mm. and uh, like <laughs> years ago, and I was just like this sounds like you just like make a goal and try to do it. Like I don't really see the point of that's this. That's a secret, right? That Good fucking secret, luck. Man. You got Good it. Good luck. Yeah. Well, you're yeah, gonna well, be you, driving you, Grubhub again soon because after that fucking nightmare <laughs> set you just played, bro, you're you're blacklisted from this town. I just want you to know that. We actually yeah. brought you on here to see if you like want to appeal, like make an appeal to the dubstep community to <laughs> yeah. remove your blacklist status. Actually, I think that'd be actually, and especially in audio form, I think that'd be good if you just yeah. kind of made a public statement. Uh, that's that's why I have all these cameras. <laughs> yeah, so, yeah. I, was, I um, feel like I'm doing it. Here, I need to hold the mic. Yeah, yeah go ahead. And, uh, uh, dubstep community, I would just like to make a formal apology mm-hmm. and appeal to re-enlist my dubstep card. I have been uh, slinging wubs since 2012. This has been a part of my heart. My heart beats at 140 beats per minute. I uh this isn't funny guys. Laugh. I live laugh. I live laugh and breathe dubstep. Mm. Um I just want to make the sickest drops for you guys. I want to uh, make the sickest mosh pits happen at the shows. I want to see all the headbangers. They call them headbangers, the fans. Yeah, the filthiest animals yeah. on the floor. Uh yeah. the, I want to see the sickest filthiest headbangers mm. just out there breaking their necks on the rail. For sure. Um, Stop. Just one. Mm-hmm. Stop the scoffing. <laughs> yeah, why is everyone laughing? Serious. So, uh, Mr. Dubstep and all the fans, mm. this is just my formal apology. And this will be written and posted on my website. Um, and I would ask for just a moment of silence and solidarity with all of the headbangers that I disappointed the other night. That was honestly very brave of you, dude. Yeah. Thank, <laughs> thank you, man. Thank, thank you. you. Hey, thank you guys, man. This was really like... Yeah. No further questions for our client. Um, I, feel, I feel healed. Yeah. Damn. <laughs> We're just like his lawyers in front of... No, no. 
Mr. Dude. Spock's are... No, 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 no more, no more, no more, no more. Yeah, we no more, sorry, that, guys. like, rhythm video. So there's this subgenre called rhythm. Oh, yeah. And it, this is, like, this is where the serious kids are. And we made, like, a video about this, uh, like, years ago. And within the community, like, it was, like, a whole thing. Like, yeah. everybody saw this video and thought it was awesome. Yeah, and they and, it became, like, a almost unironic thing. Yeah. Did you get invited to any rhythm shows? <clears throat> no, because he was... He was already the guy. So yeah, was it was more like the, the people were going, dude, he gets it. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. And then we were kind of like, we were kidding. Yeah. And then they didn't get we were joking. Yeah. Yeah, man. Damn. They didn't see like the humor in it. They just were like, this is serious. Well, it's their life. I know. Yeah. Dude, you just made an apology. Don't fuck Oh, yeah, it yeah, up, yeah, yeah, yeah. Dude. Sorry, 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 sorry. Please, sorry, sorry. dude. Fucking lightly, dude. Show the people you have changed. Yeah, sorry. Please. Sorry. Yeah. Um, I wanted to bring up this TikTok and I think this would actually be a great segue um, of, well, you'll see. Okay. Just to talk amongst yourselves while I dig it up. Yeah. So This is what to deal with, dude. That's crazy. Let me look for this TikTok. What a fucking, this is an interesting podcast. Yeah. Yeah. What a joke. People man. are spending their good time listening to this bullshit, dude. Oh, that's if you <laughs> care about the listener. That's what I'm saying. I absolutely do. Okay. They had me on right. TMG. I started smoking a cigarette. I got bored. Did you really? Yeah. That's awesome. They pulled up some dumbass like Kim Kardashian video. <laughs> it was, like, well, this is crazy. About, oh, whoa. Kim Kardashian wasn't into fashion? I'm this sorry. is oh. crazy. They made me wear some fucking like stupid night costume. Why did they do that? I don't know. I didn't get it because I don't watch this dumb shit. Yeah, I don't know why the fuck. Yeah. I don't even know why he accepted to be on here, dude. The fuck? <laughs> so I show up and they're like, hey, can you wear this? I'm like... Sure, and they're like, yeah, so last week they said something. What was the joke? It was dumb, right? I don't remember. I was just trying to humiliate <laughs> you. even get you. paid to be here? No. no you pay must him? have a lot of fucking Come time. Come you must on, have a dude. lot of time I in your hands. I literally humiliated the dubstep scene. You think they're going to pay me to be on? Yeah, dude. He's like, he's on the outs with entertainment right now. I know. Now. I'm a loose cannon. I'm mm. shit-talking TMG right now on yeah. the pod. On the pod, bro. That's true. The, the main producer there, he's fucking- He's- quaking in his out. adidas right now his shoes are lighting up he's getting ready to fight he's getting ready to jump on him <laughs> mood ring yeah, yeah. you know you can tell when ryan's about to when <laughs> jump on you because his shoes start lighting up because his feet start <laughs> twitching <laughs> yeah. uh-oh uh-oh christmas tree he's getting active <laughs> christmas tree damn mm. it man it's this tiktok of like this dude kissing this girl dude <laughs> run from this building Fucking like we gotta holy get out of here, shit. man. Shit, he's in podcast mode. Oh my podcast god, mode. I have to find the TikTok. The amount of times, go the, the amount of times Noel too has also said "savor for the pod" makes me want to fucking throw myself out of a building. <laughs> yeah. Damn, you're in too deep, man. He yeah. is in way too fucking deep. <laughs> yeah, I don't even talk to my friends anymore. I just say, "Yo, save it." For I the will pod. say this kind of inter- this uh, is I guess cool what we're sitting here is this coaster looks like a butthole, dude. Now that's interesting. Oh, riveting commentary, man. Just saying. <laughs> is this, this film? Yeah. Yeah, that's uh, that's our promo thing. Cool, man. I thought it was pretty cool. <laughs> I'm going to get it framed up. <laughs> oh. God damn it. I'm a, I'm here. I know I saved it. Oh, my God. Who cares? <laughs> God, dude, look at my friend here. Let's deal. Sorry. This is also your friend on this podcast. I don't know what to say to him. Yeah, we don't even know each other. I barely know him. I've talked, I've talked with you yeah. once. Why don't you fucking learn how to communicate with people, Hunter, that aren't your fucking... Oh, I'm um, getting a text, man. Let me check. Go ahead. I feel like I was yeah. going to yeah. pull up my phone, too. I'm like, I feel, I feel like I'm uh, not a part of the club here now. Yeah. Cool, man. We should do like a tattoo tour or something. Oh, dude, Pantera. Hell yeah. Pantera. <laughs> Sick, man. Just like that. My wife did a lot of these tattoos. I really? stopped talking and this podcast completely falls apart. But when, it's true, you're the glue, dude. You're yeah. The glue. When there's a guest, but as soon as as soon as it's just you and me, you're good to go. You got so much to say. Yeah. But all of a sudden we got I'm a sorry, guest. I'm on sorry here. I'm being respectful to your guest, dude. My I'm guest. To, yeah. yeah, your guest. I didn't invite him on. He didn't. It's true. He did not. <laughs> he doesn't even want me here. Last time last time we talked, we were talking about And here about Hunter that. is shaming me for being like, Spock will tee you up. And then you're like, I don't want to fucking talk to this guy. <laughs> I never said that. I never said that. It was implied. I want to put that on record that I never said that. No, Hunter. Apology video. I tell you what yeah. I did. I, yeah, I tell you what I, I No, what Hunter I, said I it. But when Spock walked in the building, Hunter was like, he's not going to be on that long, right? Like this. Yeah. Is- I did say that. I said, you. this is our hour. Mm-hmm. I hope you realize that. Like, <laughs> Daddy needs his time in the light is what I said. 
I said that verbatim. Yeah. And he was like, dubstep DJ? Does anyone even listen to that anymore? Yeah. I'm like, he doesn't do that anymore. And you're like, okay, fine. I'll let him on. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You know what? Fuck it. I'm not even going to, you know, take your lies and we'll make them truths, dude. Yeah. <laughs> That's what I got to say. You okay, Hunter? Fucking itchy neck. <laughs> An itchy neck. Is that good podcast yeah, material? Yeah, it's good podcast material. Yeah, my, my neck is itchy as fuck right now. Dude, you, you uh, did you... Mm, Sorry, I just had a stroke. Are you? That was funny. That was a good bit. Good one, man. Did your B Dub wings kill you? You you made this threat to me yesterday. We had Buffalo Wild Wings yesterday, and Hunter's like, "It's gonna fuck your shit up." And I ate it, and I was fine. I'm surprised you're fine. You like usually you have anything, and you're like, "Oh man, I'm messed up." Yeah. Like man, like for real, like uh. I don't that's know what I did. Yeah, that's yeah, crazy. Yeah. It's pretty good. That's isn't yeah. it? It's pretty yeah. good. That's pretty good. Yeah. yeah. No talk like. What me. do you mean? What, what, you no, it's, good. Like it? it's good. I like. What do you think it was racist? Do it again. No, I wish it was a little more racist. <laughs> <laughs> oh, do your impression of Harry's mom again. Hello, nice to meet you. No, come also, on. Also, Harry's mom. I've never done that. Harry, I haven't done that, and you know I haven't done that. You know I'd never do that because his mom's passed away. Actually, so I bet you feel like a real asshole now, don't you? No, because I didn't know that. <laughs> what I don't know can't hurt me. No. Yeah. No. There you go. Well, now you know. Do the impression. <laughs> I know. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> no, my B dubs was very good last night. It's yeah. good. I was just a tired boy. Had to go home. You also decided to go see a certain film at ten thirty at night, uh, and I I thought I had the courage and the dexterity to do it, but I yeah. didn't. By the time the we were done eating, I I I I can't. Yeah, I said tap out. Yeah, tap out. So I said and I went home and I went to bed. Yeah, would you would you you just slept? That's all yeah. you did. Yeah. Yeah. Any- what else was I supposed to do? I don't know. <laughs> Fucking roll around in the mud like you always do. <laughs> roll around in the mud. <laughs> roll around the mud. Beat my, beat off my dick a little bit. And, <laughs> you know, really catch some strong Z's is what I did. <laughs> you don't oh, beat off, man. Stop it. No, I don't. You don't do any physical activity. Not at all. Absolutely not. <laughs> I, I get up and I lay down. That's what I do. Yeah. <laughs> that, that's all the exercise I get every day. Are you uncomfortable? No, no, I'm good. You, you said rolling around in the mud, and it reminded me of this other pretty good story. Uh, when I was story? DJ, I was the DJ. Oh, dude, yeah. I was yeah in, t- uh, tell the DJ story while I look up this TikTok. <laughs> <laughs> I was in uh, Houston on tour. And this, uh, there was somebody who like knew some girl who was like the daughter of like a rich oil person or something. So they had like a thousand acre like ranch or something like that. And so we parked the tour bus there for the night and we were just like hanging out there. And it was this dude's first day on the tour. And, uh, he was like nervous and his buddy convinced him to get like really drunk and they had a pig there. And... <laughs> Oh, I remember this. Remember I remember this? this. And everyone convinced him to go wrestle the pig in the mud in his underwear. Mm. So he was like super drunk. Everyone was like standing around, like laughing. And it was really funny at first. And then we all were kind of just like, eh, this is kind of weird. And then so like he was just like super drunk wrestling a pig in the mud. And then, like, after a minute or two, everyone was just like, this is weird, man. Like, you shouldn't do this. And then, so, like, it was something that he thought would, like, make him accepted into the group. Mm. And then we, me and my buddy were, like, walking back to the other area. And we were just, it was just us. And they had all gone back in a car. And me and him just looked at each other. And we were like, yeah, I don't think I really like that dude, Adam. Like, that was really weird. <laughs> and, like, so I was just like, everyone convinced him to do something. And then everyone was like, that was weird. You shouldn't have done that. That's like that racist one-liner you did the other the other week. Which one? When we were like, dude, say it. And I had the funny shirt on and you were like, no, I can't. And then you said it and it was like really fucked up. And that I, happens a lot. So I don't know which one you're talking about. No. Actually, no, this was yesterday. You were going to do a one-liner about my shirt and me. And you said it was racist. We, I was like, dude, you're, you're like. Oh, yeah. Never, I didn't even finish yeah. my thought on that. Yeah, say it. I forgot what it was. Really? I did. Damn it. I'm sorry. Also, I wouldn't do it here. We do that in private, remember? <laughs> we're good people like that. <laughs> we're racist to each yeah, other. Yeah, we're, we're, we're racist to each other in private. <laughs> like good like good people. Yeah. <laughs> Definitely. Not like Ryan. 
who's so open about it. Yeah, yeah. But where did it come from, Ryan? You know where that came from. <laughs> Ryan, you know how you talk off camera. Yeah. To yeah. our faces. Yeah, I have some videos on my phone recorded of Ryan where it is very questionable. <laughs> <laughs> Zero videos of me on <laughs> yeah. I, will, I love that Ryan hates when we joke about him being an awful person. Because <laughs> I'm he, not an awful person. <laughs> he, lets it, he won't even let it go one second. He's like, no, 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 no. Yeah. <laughs> he always does that. No, 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 no. Stop. Stop. Like, we talk about Ryan being like, I can't stand like pale children. No. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Why don't you like pale kids? <laughs> he said that specifically. He was I don't like, like pale kids either. <laughs> Yeah, but when you say it, it's fine. Yeah, when you say it, it's okay. Oh. Well, Ryan says I'm, it's right, I'm right there with you, dude. I don't fucking like him. <laughs> I don't like babies in general. Yeah, you're, kids, not, you're not doing it, right? No kids. Hell no. It's just no. Mm -hmm. Nope. You think you want to have kids, Fuck? Yeah. How Why many do you think you want to have? <laughs> yeah. I don't know. <laughs> I, don't I, do, know. I, I, do like, I do like that answer, though. <laughs> think you have kids? Yeah. I don't know. It just seems like... <laughs> what's Dude, this is such, such a stupid story. I was in an Uber one time and the driver was super old and I was just, he was just like making conversation. And I was like, what's the thing that you're like, you're most proud of in your life? And he's like, having children. And I was like, pretty fucking, I should probably have life. kids. Uh, huh? Oh, I thought you were going to say pretty uneventful fucking life. If that's the, I don't know. That's kids it? are cool. Why would you not want to have kids? I nah, no, didn't. <laughs> yeah. No, you should boring, boring, boring. Having a kid. Imagine. Well, the kid part, probably like whenever you probably all excited and I feel like as soon as you hear your kid talk or you figure out what kind of kid they're going to be, you're like, you're really rolling the dice there. You're like mm. crossing your fingers, like, I hope this is a cool kid. But it, imagine like the devastation in your heart when you're like, my kid fucking sucks. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. Would you try to change it? No. I don't think you can. They just are. <laughs> it just is. I think, I, like, just, I, I, I think that's how it is. Well, fuck. Okay. And you're kind of just stuck with it. Well, there it goes. Yeah. Do that kind of thing. You should definitely have kids. You should have a lot of them yeah. with this attitude. Roll, 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 roll the dice. <laughs> yeah. I'm just Daddy's a gambler like, by yeah. heart. Ten yeah. kids. Yeah, ten kids. Like... He hates them all. Yeah. Except the one. The one that plays football and that's going to yeah. go to the military. He's like, that's the good one. No, I think I just want... If I had if I had it my way, it'd be a, a boy and a girl and that'd be it. And I'd just be like, that's just... That's what it was. Okay. Good luck. What type good of... Luck. What, what does that, that mean? I thought like that's pretty fair. Is that not fair? Just at one years old, you're like, all right, see ya. No, whenever they're talking, like probably, I don't know, when, when do kids start talking? When do kids start talking? Does anyone in here even have kids? Um, I feel like there's like so many like 40-year-olds in this room and none of them have children. Ryan, you're 43, right? How old are you? 35. Oh, 35. Yeah. Oh, whatever. Round up. 40. You have 40. a kid though, don't you? Oh, fuck. Okay. Yeah. I don't know. I thought you had a kid too for some reason. <laughs> It's, it's those shoes, man. We <laughs> thought you definitely no, had a kid wearing those shoes, dude. I don't know. It's because you're married, and no, I was like, yeah, oh, yeah, he has a kid. No one's married. Yeah, but like, <laughs> I saw him get married, and like, you were already married, I think. Yeah. So yeah, if you're best, already married honestly, before I know yeah, you. You're, you're just like, yeah, best decision you ever made, buddy. Yeah. yeah. That's, is that what you said to him? When he got married? Yeah. I don't, I don't know if I said that. I no. feel like you would have said something like that. Like, that would be in your cadence. Honestly, Happiest day of your life. No. <laughs> Ryan actually, like, he was like, don't, don't yeah. do it. Do it. I hope you had her sign some papers. Yeah, that's what he said. She's going to take it. Yeah. Everything. Yeah. Yeah, that's what he said. All your assets gone. Yeah. Learn from my mistakes. Yeah, Ryan actually broke character. He was like, bro, you got married? Yeah. Dude, Ooh. fucking, I'm never getting married. To who? Bro. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Yikes. Yeah. Oh. That's a Ryan. great, for the record. Thank you, yeah. That's not what I heard. <laughs> <laughs> I'll let you talk that shit. You're going to go on her show. You can handle that. Yeah, I'm going I'm to be, be on there tomorrow. Being like, why you suck so much, dude? <laughs> yeah, you make my boy's life like hard. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god you just go on her podcast and you're like yo let my boy come out more what the fuck he's always like so like held up like let him chill every time i hang out you're always there like what the fuck is up with that <laughs> y'all live together or some shit yeah. like it's corny like god damn dude you guys are around each other all day chill dude take a couple hours apart fuck yeah that's how i feel dude <sighs> yeah yeah nope no kids probably not gonna happen that's all right Wait, are you married? Yep.
Okay, I, I Hunter's thought, I 45. Thought were... That's why he's insecure about age and shit, because right, he's okay. 45. I am 45. Google it. Yeah. Pull it up on Google. How old is me, Keenan, on Google? What does it say today? Let's see. It always, it's always changing. Someone's always trying to make it a, a smaller number, and it's like, that's not the number. Yeah, 40. 40. 40. Right, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Crazy. Yeah. Always change, but famous birthdays coming yeah. in. Very, yeah. very true. Yeah. Very wow. Wait, well, the, click on it. Who's he associated with? I want to see that. <laughs> That's a great picture, dude. Wow, you're 10,051 most popular. <laughs> That's pretty good. You're a top 10,000 meat canyon. Nice, dude. I'm associated with Nicki Minaj. <laughs> you're a number. You're the number three 40 year old Capricorn, bro. <laughs> Let's go, <laughs> yeah, dude. dude. Yeah. <laughs> Ah, oh, fuck. Now people know my sign, dude. Wow. Uh, I'm have some crazy bitches in my messages now. Yeah. Yeah, figured. Uh, you know what I mean? Oh, nice you and Ice Spice, Spice man. Me and Ice Spice. And Brent too. Rivera. Wow. Who the fuck's Brent Rivera? You don't remember Brent Rivera? He was, uh, from Vine? Remember him? Is he not around anymore? What happened to him? Yeah, he died in a car crash. Oh, he's young. 25. <laughs> no, I'm just When did he die in the car I just car saw that <laughs> dude like a year ago. <laughs> That's fucked. Brent Rivera. No, I've never heard of him. Um, he's he's popular on yeah. Vine. Is he just like a YouTube guy? Yeah, now okay. he is. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, he was a Vine guy as well. Yeah. I see. I see. Yeah. yeah. Okay. <laughs> Very cool. <Yeah>. Very cool. <laughs> this is this is awesome. <laughs> this is really cool, man. <laughs> I'm just I'm like I'm like picturing a guy like who listens to our podcast just driving to work and he's like. <laughs> It's us being like Britt Rivera. Who's Britt Rivera? And he's just like, I don't know. Either. Yeah. If I wasn't here, what would you guys be talking about? Bullshit. Nothing. Okay. Nothing. Okay. Yeah. Nothing at all. I want you to know this is honestly our most okay. exciting episode we've ever had. It's low this pressure, race. man. All right, cool. I, I, would, yeah. I didn't know what like the vibes were here. The, there's no like, vibes. Okay. Okay. Yeah. There's nothing. It's a very fucking meek and yeah. It's it's a it's a bleak show. I think I've realized. The more cameras you add to a podcast, the worse it gets. The worse it gets. One hundred percent. Yeah, yeah. We should just have like a tripod with like a fucking iPhone yeah. on it, with like a ring light. Yep. <laughs> a little VHS cam. Yeah. yeah. Agree. I'm still trying to find these fucking people kissing. Also, pot like two guys who are married and are like old shouldn't have a fucking podcast. What the fuck are you all the cool about? podcasts are young, hip kids living in LA talking about sucking and fucking and what all they're doing. Yeah, well, you can't get any of those stories. That's you're not us. We're sixteen. So. Yeah, we're sixteen. You're the one. You're that's forty. Like old. I am forty. Yeah, <laughs> I've been around the block a time or two. You have some crazy stories. Can you? Talk I about, wish I was. Can you talk 16 about Cube? Again? Can you talk about Cube? Because he, he no, Cube. he DJed at Gathering oh, of the Juggalos. Yeah. I, 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 have we skipped over that? I don't I know what the fuck that. you're talking about. Cube? Were you bullshitting me? I don't. I don't know what you're saying. To <laughs> Were me. you bullshitting me about your clown love? Oh, like the insane clown posse? Yeah, but no, I haven't been to any of that. No, but your juggalette. Oh, <laughs> Cube. I don't know why it took me so long to. I don't know why it took me so long to figure that out. Yeah, can you talk about Cube? I don't know. No, yeah. No, no. I don't think. I don't, I don't think I'll sip. divulge in a cube today. <laughs> Maybe some That's other a private time. Conversation. That is a private conversation kind of thing. You guys can pontificate on that all you want. The guy, uh, the guy, finally in the car has he's like grinning a little bit. He's like, yeah, he's, "What is this? <laughs> what, what kind of wacky story is that about?" <laughs> Yeah, oh no. Well, that, yeah, that'll that'll be for some other Holy time, I think. Shit. Not the, today. <laughs> Yo, your fucking not the, body language. Not the funny. He, he went. <laughs> you turned away. I that's the first away. time you've turned away from that, me. That's oh a. Uh, that's definitely a. Uh, that's that. Well, 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 um, not today. <laughs> <laughs> not 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 today on Cube. I don't think. Nope. Nope. <laughs> not today. Do we have to cut this out. Nah, I mean, we didn't say anything. No, okay. All right. I don't think she'll know or anything. Or anything like that jazz. One day we'll have to talk about Cube. One of these days, we I'll, 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 I'll tell the story one day. Yeah. When I'm ready. Yeah. When I'm ready. <laughs> That'll be your press. Your press release. Dude. I'll show up in a suit, and you'll know it's real fucking business. <laughs> yeah. Oh, we're about to talk about ICT Cube. Soon. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> we're talking about Cube. Uh.
Yeah, gathering yeah, of the yeah, Juggalos. Yeah, I went to the gathering, man. dude. It was the most insane thing I've ever seen. I hear it's really seen. fun. It was like... Like chaos, like a nightmare fun. Like <clears> it's, was. It's, like there's a lot of shit that I know is uh, just like you feel like you shouldn't be there, but then it kind of keeps reeling you back in where you're like, oh God, and then kind of yeah. keeps presenting itself. It's a very, uh, you know, they love each other. They love each other there. They, yeah. It's, it's a very open atmosphere. Very it is open extremely atmosphere. open. <laughs> it was really crazy. Did you play there? Yeah, I DJed for these uh, rappers that were performing. What were the rappers' names? City Morgue. City Morgue. It's yeah. like a bank. <laughs> City this, Morgue? Just a little bit. Yeah, like I know Morgue is what it is. Yeah. But I just, I don't know. I mean, City, City Morgue City. Financial. Yeah, I guess it could, yeah. City Morgue. Maybe I'm just thinking City Bank. Right. Yeah. Yeah, City Bank. But yeah, it was... Don't, they don't throw, shake your head. That's what you're thinking of, buddy. They, <laughs> trust me. Trust me. They throw great, stuff at you. Great rates there, all right? Honestly, great place to get a home and a loan. You'll find out about it when you're older. Don't worry. <sighs> yeah. I, they, they, they throw, throw stuff at you. Like what? Like... Oh, bro, how do we miss that? Hot dogs. You have to tell that. Hot dogs. Did you eat them? No, they, so it was really interesting. I don't really know why, whether they like you or not, they throw stuff at you. So I was fully prepared to like, they throw like Fago at you and stuff. That sounds, that makes sense. Yeah. But they also throw other things and like Riff Raff the day before had just got like booed off stage and like got a bunch of shit thrown at me. He left. Uh, so I was like worried about that. Um, but yeah, so I'm up there DJing. I'm a DJ. And they... Uh, he doesn't really do that anymore, but... Yeah. He did it for the but gathering. But I did it for the gathering. Can you play some of your music over the mic so we can hear it? Well, I was playing their music. No, I meant like your new music. You keep saying you're a DJ, but you're not a DJ anymore. So what do, What the fuck do you do? Listen, I just man. make rap beats. Like on Spot, like in Spotify? Can I check it? Like yeah. type in Spock music? Yeah, yeah. I'll come up. Okay. Yeah. Um, <laughs> okay, well, don't say come on because I don't know. No, I said I'll come up. Okay. Um. Yeah, so they're throwing stuff. They were like... I thought they were burnt hot dogs, mm. but they were just raw hot dogs spray painted black. I, I don't know why they spray painted. You could just throw a regular hot dog. I don't know why. Uh, hot dogs are pretty inexpensive, so you can just yeah. But why <laughs> why spray paint them? Hey, I gotta, didn't get it. Got a so yeah. They throw spray them in your hand and, like they'd hit the stage and just like explode. <laughs> so they're just like exploding <laughs> hot dogs and like and uh, pickles. Was the set at least lit? It was lit. It was pretty lit. Bro, How many people were on. there? Uh, a couple I don't thousand? Know. Yeah, probably like 10,000. <laughs> oh, maybe, wow. maybe that's, our, that's a lot of people. Maybe like five to 10,000. That's a lot there of people. There's a lot of people. Yeah. Um, but yeah, they're throwing stuff. Like I got hit in the face with a pickle. <laughs> and it was just, it was just something hit me in the face. And I was like, oh, what? Did you hook up with any juggalos or juggalettes? No, no, no. Did you try? No. Dude, can I just re I, Spock messaged us that night. He goes, I'm back at the hotel now. Well, what? Is it okay if we talk about your private conversation? Oh yeah, I don't, I don't think I said. Don't go ahead. No, crazy, right? Yeah, no. It's, I'm just respectful, dude. Yeah, yeah. Shut up. <laughs> Garrett says, "I'm back at the hotel now, bro. They throw stuff on stage, whether they like you or not. They're throwing pickles. I got hit in the face. <laughs> it's just such a crazy thing to type after doing a set, like because I I didn't really have time to process it. <laughs> and then I get back to the hotel. And I'm laying in bed, and I was like. My face kind of hurt. <laughs> I was like, I really got hit in the face with a pickle tonight. You I'm, didn't camp out in the at the. No, because I was only there for the one day, and then I had oh, to go home. Leave. Yeah, yeah. Say, where, where, where is it? At? Is it always in the same spot? It's always the same spot. It's in uh, the middle. It's like an hour outside of Columbus, Ohio. Okay, so it's like just, fully just in the middle of nowhere. Hmm. And like, yeah. How was, big was the pickle? There was a couple different sizes. Mm. So. They were throwing the little baby ones, the little tiny ones. And the one I got in the face with was a little bigger, but it wasn't a full size. That's pickle. aim though. I know. I don't know. I don't know how they do it. Just yeah. Um Hunter, you okay? I'm just listening to the story. <laughs> All right. You're the one who took if you let me tell you something. Oh, uh, here if we I, go. If here's, I hear, here's the hunter, let me tell you something. Go ahead. If I hear a private text between us being just thrown around without permission, I'm gonna be fucking livid. I don't give a shit what little bubblegum show you're on. Uh -huh. I'm going to fuck you up, dude. Okay. Well, it'll be this show. <laughs> well, that that's well this is this is two. This is our show that's that's fine. Yeah. But let me tell you if I see anything else. Yeah. I will I'll walk. <laughs> oh, then I'm going to do it. 
Hey, <laughs> hey, come on, man. I'm a crucial part of the show. Come on now. Yeah, I want you. You're supposed, you're supposed to say, no, no. Yeah, no. If you're, oh, yeah, I'm sorry. If you, say that. if you just told me you're going to like walk to come whoop my ass, I'm leaking so many texts. No, no, I'm walking. I'm leaving the show. Uh, That's what I mean by walking. Oh, well, then I won't do that. There we go. Now I feel validated, so I feel this is fine. <laughs> I'm a little mad because these mics are really cool. Oh, I'm sorry. And th this is like... We are kind of a DJ and kind of not, so we don't know what the fuck to give you. <laughs> we didn't know what the fuck. Didn't know if I should have like a MIDI pad up here or if I was like a fucking... Kind of shit. I didn't know what was going on. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, I, used to, uh, yeah I used to use these a lot. Yeah. Not anymore. Yeah. But, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Damn, we just get you CDJs for no reason. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, mixing the podcast. Yeah, real time mixing. Yeah, he doesn't do that anymore. So though. what do you do now, man? Yeah, Nothing. You, fucking yeah. lazy piece Not of a shit. Thing. Just be a piece of shit usually. You're like a little animator, so you make like cartoons or something, right? I make cringe for children. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> that's pretty much what I do. CFC. That's my uh, that's my job title. I have quite the quirky fan base online. Yeah, that's what I say. I make cringe for children. CFC. Yeah. Crazy. I love that phrasing, man. No problem, dude. Not really sure if that's a response, but yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, <laughs> it's like a really awkward like interaction with like a uncle or something, where it's like you're trying desperately to be like, well, I guess that's it. You that's know, what, it's like it's like people are just like we're 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 lingering here, like almost like somebody's like you have to spend time. <laughs> yeah, so it yeah. feels like that. <laughs> And I got a giant fucking clock right there just being like, mm -mm. Yeah. eight more minutes. Not oh, yet. Yeah. This happens when you do three hours in a row. This has been a, a, a slog of an episode. Yeah. Oh, stop it. So, you agree, yeah. right? You can feel it yeah. in there. Everybody can. Ovi back there, she's no, just like. Oh, you're fucking being insecure. And she's going to have to run up after this and be like, it was great. And then she's lying yeah. to her straight to her face. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Knowing full well this shit sucks. It's a fucking brutal one. Mm. And you know what? We did our best. And you know what? Here's the thing, too. Here's a fucking news flash, dude. Well, we did three in a row. Well, that's what I'm saying is don't get your hopes up when listening to this. <laughs> Moving forward, even. There's going to be some duds. That's what this This whole episode is a box that's of milk duds, dude. That's just. That's every podcast. I, I agree. I'm just, I'm saying. I'm just, I, it's like, I'm yeah, seeing it right now. I don't listen to this shit, dude? Yeah. I don't blame you. I don't it's blame you. It's funny you make jokes about the guy in the car. He turned it off already, like 30 yeah, minutes ago. Yeah, he, he de he's definitely at work, and he's he just like, what a great one. Yeah. yeah. But you know, yeah. Yeah, yeah he heard he's dubstep. dubstep. No. Yeah, he's like, yeah. this guy's a dubstep DJ? <laughs> Click. Wait, okay, never mind. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, the comments like, anyone else think the pods just felt a little off lately? Oh, dude, every time. Yeah. You have one bad episode. Are they okay? Yeah. I think Hunter has diabetes. You're like, what does, yeah. does that have to do with anything? Okay, wow, so you have eyes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Damn it. Oh. But, no, his episode was good. The first 30, just flaming Ryan. That was fun. Yeah. I, I do wish that we could have flamed him more. Yeah, we could. I mean, dude, we got four left. We could fucking rock out. We do. <laughs> Ryan, did rock you ever out. get bullied in high school? Yeah, a lot. Oh, damn. Oh, it. Now oh, it's sad. Oh, now it's oh, fucking yeah, sad, dude. Fuck, fuck man. you. Not funny, damn it. Yeah, now you made Come it on, fucking man. sad. God damn it. <laughs> yeah, all the time. <laughs> By every, every single oh, it'd be day. To say. It'd be embarrassing to say. God. The theater kids. Was it theater kids? No. I'm just guessing. It? You said it's embarrassing. Well, who is it? Uh, <laughs> you really want me to tell you? Yeah. Why not? A guy named Brian and then this girl named Emily bullied me a lot. Were they dating? No. Just separately why? bullies. Why? Why do they do that? What would they bully you about? Did you fucking smack <laughs> One of them both Emily in the mouth? made fun of me a lot for my shoes. I wore green shoes <laughs> once. Oh, no, dude. Are you actually serious? And you didn't learn? Like, yeah. <laughs> That was pretty good. Was pretty good. Oh, no, Ryan, shit. you don't have to say that. Now it's, it's, now it's <laughs> fucking sad. Dude. Oh, dude. That's exactly what he said in fucking high school, too. Yeah. <laughs> oh, good one, one guys. <laughs> the shoes do look like awesome, Peter Pan Brian. shoes. Brian. Yeah, another sick burn. You're yeah. the coolest, man. Okay. What what age was this? Uh, 16. You were getting bullied for green shoes at 16? Yeah, well, it was one of those, like, shoes popular girl, and I was like, pretty nerdy and mm -hmm. i was uh, in choir and i remember her coming up to me and being like 
Why are you wearing those shoes? They're ugly. They're green. You should have said, how about you shut up, bitch? That's what you should have said. <laughs> Didn't have that confidence. You should have. That's what you should have said. If you can go back in time, you should say that. Okay. Probably because yeah. these shoes are fucking awesome. Why Why do you have so much gum when you smile? That's what you should have said. Just make up some <laughs> shit, gaslighter. <laughs> God, your teeth are so small. You should have said. Your yeah. hair's weird. God, ugh. Yeah. Okay. You're popular. Whatever. Yeah, sick yeah. burn from the chick with the small head. Right, guys? And then you have to say, right, right guys? guys? Yeah, Everyone's yeah. like... Uh, <laughs> sure, yeah. <laughs> They're afraid to say it. They don't want yeah. to comment on your small teeth and your small head. You realize everyone calls you donkey breath behind your <laughs> behind your back, right? Just some real heinous shit. <laughs> you know, you do like, hey, like, I never say this, but like, <laughs> yeah, prefacing something with that. I'm not this kind of person. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm not this kind of person. Hit but with you... that or hit with like, uh, oh, like, here's it, like, like nobody else, like I, we're cool, but like, like oh yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah like, listen, 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 I don't have a problem with. I don't have a problem. I don't with think you. you're a big deal, but people hate. You. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> honestly, I don't think I don't know really know what they're saying, but like honestly, a lot of people don't like yeah. you. I know we do like the shoe I think thing. Your teeth are fine. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> they're yeah. not too small. Yeah, exactly. People call you like corn on the cob teeth all the time. And like, I don't think like, I don't think it's like, yeah. I don't know. Like, I'm just the messenger. So I don't whatever. agree. Like your teeth aren't that small. But you have to do that like a week or two later. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You're like, oh yeah. And then yeah, you come back. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, What kind of shoes were they? Is there anything about her or him, Brian, that you remember distinctly that made them suck? Oh, it's just their personalities. Yeah, but what did they? What was physically wrong with them? You can, you can definitely, you can definitely tell this was like the nerdy guy who got picked on. He's like, it was just really like, just their moods and their personalities. Like what I didn't like about them. Like, yeah. well, too much school, of a nice guy. In high dude. school, you're you're popular if you're hot, and so they were both. That's not true. I was extremely obese, and I was w really liked. I had a great time in high school because you had a good personality, though. Okay, that's true. My personality was. Hot. What did Brian go on to do? Realty. I bet you anything yeah, it's realty. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, realty. Yeah, Almost every single douchebag I knew in high school was just yeah. like, yeah, I mean, I'm like moving houses right now. Yeah. Yeah. Do you know what happened to her? No. Nope. Realty. <laughs> <laughs> Probably. I don't know. Yeah. I don't think I've met a single person that's happy that's been in, like, a, that's like a realtor. I just realized, hold on, this is distracting me because this chair is broken. Yeah. Mm. And I just realized, I'm pretty sure this is the same yep. chair from like yeah. the old, old, old studio. Yeah, it is. And you have 20 fucking cameras. Yeah. <laughs> Nobody's bought a new we chair. We gotta think about our priorities here. <laughs> yeah. All right. Yeah. Well, yeah. DJs usually stand yeah, up. Yeah, so yeah I was gonna say. Yeah. I'm not used to like yeah. sitting. Yeah. yeah. Usually I'm, I'm like. You're not jumping. <laughs> yeah. You're yeah. waving your arms. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Headbangers. Yeah, yeah, little gremlins are trying to get fucking lit tonight. Yeah. Headbangers, where you at? Yeah. <sighs> yeah, I'll show you some videos after the pod. It's pretty. I can't wait. I'm going to immediately get into the culture of it. Oh, yeah, you will. Yeah, I'm going to be a, do what they call them, dub heads? What's like a dubstep? Fanatic. Headbangers, dude. That's, so they're just legitimately, headbangers. that's headbangers. what people call them. It's, that's kind of misleading. I feel like that's yeah. like more of like a rock thing, right? That's yeah. what you think, yeah. Mm. Ryan, did anyone else bully you? <laughs> Dang, dude. <laughs> Ryan's just like, oh, cool. Time's up, yeah. guys. Yeah. Just therapy that's a, hour that's, for Ryan. You know what? Yeah. I, I'm, I'm, I'm officially putting my foot down on this subject. Fucking down, dude. I just want to know if it like many people hated the green shoes or just these two people. No, the green shoes specifically was one instance with Emily. Got it. Who made like what brand of shoe? I think they were Adidas, but. Green I'm, Adidas I, aren't bad though. I bet, I bet you anything they're probably very normal shoes. Yeah. Yeah. No, I yeah. can I can picture now. Even if they're all green, that's normal. But in my mind, <clears throat> in my heart, I really, really wish that they were like some Peter Pan shoes. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> that, yeah. He, that he was yeah. just like he's like, Big, well, like what about them? Yeah. 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 He had like bells on the end of them. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like walking yeah. the hallway. Yeah. Everyone else is like, cool shoes, Ryan. Like trying to be supportive. He's like, thanks. And one girl's like, those are fucking lame. I was bullied. Your in mood high is school. so sour. <laughs> <laughs> I was bullied, guys. Like, oh, yeah, really? Yeah. <laughs> oh, that sucks, man. Do you have a picture of them? <laughs> like, yo, those suck, man. <laughs> they were pretty normal they shit. They were just a couple of normal shit kickers. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's so sad, Ryan. Yeah. Can I see them? Even that'd be kind of lit, honestly. Yeah. I imagine Ryan walking around with some, like basketball yeah. shorts on with those. That'd be tight, dude. Some ankle socks. Hell yeah. Yeah. Hell yeah. 
Yeah, they're probably like those. Just like, literally like, point out which like, ones they were, yeah. right? We're going to yeah. scroll really slow, <laughs> and we want you to just point at the, the screen ones. whenever you're ready. You were in high school when? 1970. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. They probably won't be on here. They were more athletic type shoes. <laughs> Ryan's just going to class in cleats. <laughs> <laughs> Full on. Yeah. <laughs> She's like, what the fuck are you doing? <laughs> I got work after school today. <laughs> Working like Arby's and cleats. <laughs> Beef and cheddar to go. Thank you. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> Ryan just slipping everywhere because they have no grip. So anytime there's this mild puddle, he's just annoying. Just, <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. Uh, Sorry, Ryan. <clears throat> Damn. I think it's fucking disgusting, this conversation. <laughs> Do you actually? That's, I could... my, that's my boss, dude. Oh, yeah. I'm going to get a, a stern talking to after this. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> nah, man. Damn, Ryan just boots us all with cleats. <laughs> just in the yeah, back of the pay, fucking pay head. His office. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Here's the fucking thing, guys. <laughs> it's all good and fun for a little bit. <laughs> but he went overboard. He's like, <laughs> he's like, <laughs> talk about the cleats again. He's like, we don't talk about Brian and Emily because they're not alive anymore. <laughs> I kicked them right through the heart. Do you fucking catch? My drift. <laughs> Please got, answer. Got a pair of cleats in his office. They have just blood stains. Like, <laughs> Sh- yeah, and like a shadow box or whatever. Yeah, the fuck yeah, it is. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Damn it, bro. What another riveting episode of Stretch yeah. and Fade. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. <laughs> hey, Ovi, was it a good episode? <laughs> and Ovi, give us a big yeehaw if you thought the episode was good. Yo, yeah, yeah, she, yeah. She's, she, she gave you the honest truth right there. She's like, I'm yeah, not doing like, yeah, that. Yeah, I mean, that, that's, 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 it's a, it's a no. It's a no. <laughs> yeah. That's okay. I thought it was magical. She knows we're coming for her next week. We, I'm not going to be here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, we don't fuck with Ovi. <laughs> no. Yeah, it'd just be mean. Yeah. It'd be uncalled for. I think it's just you're pushing too many boundaries and buttons. Yeah. It's like, just to say. Well, Ovi actually works, but Ryan. Yeah. <laughs> 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 No, we're kidding. We're kidding. We're kidding. Yeah. All right. Anyway, is that it? Done. Are we done? All right. Good. Yeah. Cool. Be good. Um, dude, Spock, thanks for jumping in. (laughs) I don't know. I I thought it was funny his whole experience. You know, I don't have to justify it. Yeah, don't justify it. Please don't justify it. Yeah. 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 You're gonna be tuning in though to this episode. Yeah. 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 You're definitely gonna listen to this episode. All the comments are gonna be like, "This is the worst 48 minutes of my life." This is oh, bro. Oh yeah. Yeah. Blacklist podcast. Yeah. I tune into this podcast for pure comedy, and then Spock comes in and talks about top 40s <laughs> and what was a hell hole 48 minutes, dude. Yep. All right, man. Well, thank you everyone for tuning in. Um, Ryan, we love you, man. Sorry, Sorry dude. <laughs> Sorry we went so hard on your yeah. shoes, dude. I genuinely feel like, damn, it's not fun anymore. I want to drag this out because Hunter looks done, and I just want to keep it going. I feel like I have nothing left to give. The silence is so uncomfortable. <laughs> Why? I don't no, know. It's not, dude. You're just bombing. Know. It's okay. I don't know these people as well as you do. So Why are you I being feel, weird? I feel, I, feel, I feel like just like I like I'm gonna have a, like a panic attack. So, <laughs> oh, let's keep going then. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right, everyone. Thank you. We'll see you on next week's episode. Goodbye. Bye.